Welcome, sports fans. Bosco Mirage sitting in the cockpit of a V12 Formula One car. And all I can say is, for any of y'all who says sound does not matter, y'all must be mighty young because, woohoo! Ah, these things are awesome. Let's see. I've just put myself provisionally in third. I only like to one run one lap for quality. If I wreck or throw it off, I start in the back. Here we are. Held on to third. Six tenths off the leader. Pretty good. I think I got him at set at 70. It's... You know, these numbers mean nothing. Just try to get them set to where they race close to you, and you'll find AI issues normally aren't too bad. And we are off. We're in Brazil. <laughs> oh, that's incredible. Sense of speed is just really, really amazing. Oh, bumpy ass track. I think Analogos might have some of those same issues. <laughs> oh, a little deep, a little deep. Never drove this track until yesterday, and I've just fallen in love with it. Now look for distance pop-ups. None. Oh no, he's deep. Oh. Oh, this game is so good. I, just, I cannot tell you how good this is. <laughs> oh boy, a little aggressive on the brake still. And I got him at 76% brake pressure. And you can still lock him. But it's not out of control anymore. Definitely be careful over downshift because that'll lock like your end and spin you out faster than your brake. So here we are, the top four. So far, I haven't seen any issues with AI getting going or yeah, braking wrong, accelerating wrong. These guys look like real drivers to me. Just don't have any advantage over them. You can really feel front end loss of downforce. It may not as bad in this car, but in some of the newer F1 cars, it's real in the game too. <laughs> Just incredible. Just so incredible. Just runs fantastic. Fantastic in VR. Just not a lot of places to pass here. If they're good. And no boy, and they're good. Oh, oh my gosh, he's quick, isn't he? Like I said, they're good. I have not read anybody say the AI is anything but trash on this game, and it has not been my experience at all. You know, my guess is they're under some illusion that they have to drive at 100% AI, or they have some, 
you know, bogus number in their head like it means anything. The only thing that matters is making them competitive to you. And when you do that, this is what you get. Need a little more gear. But this is some good racing, man. Ain't nothing wrong with this. I might get him, I might get him, I might get him. It's gonna be... Oh, it's beautiful. I mean, that's racing, man. There's nothing wrong with any of that. Where's where's my AI issues? Fix your wheel. Get your... Oh, that was all me. <laughs> I had to go for it. <laughs> and there they are, man. That's... Let's see. 128.4, 128.2, 128.3. I was running com competitive laps with them. Very good. But look at these laps. Nothing wrong with that. They're it's very competitive. Very competitive. The whole field is within a couple of seconds. I mean, that's that's brilliant. So that's seventy percent, if I remember right. But you know, as an example. Don't let bad reviews run you away from this magnificent game. It is magnificent. I mean, I, there's no other word for it. Options, controls, TSPS racer. This is me, not your wheel, maybe. Calibrate your wheel first. 55 feels great I was running 100 I've changed back these very important to have at 100 all your dead zone zero this gives you a proper one to one through your range it doesn't speed up or slow down on one end or the other which is just maddening if you're trying to drive consistent uh, handbrake get that off the most important button which it was on my wheel so you don't actually hit it uh, none of that. I added, made sure these were where I wanted them. This is a very important get things like that off your wheel, you know, your camera. This is always good to know. After you set your wheel, which you should put on your wheel, set your headset right here on mine. Then, if it's your little high, little low. Then you just use your, I believe it's A and, yeah, your A and the S. Uh, and if you need to go forward or back. But normally I find when I reset, if anything, see if I look over here, it's going to reset goofy. But, and then force feedback, I'm totally happy with force feedback. This game feels brilliant right here. This is my wheel, you know. Uh, if you're running a G wheel, 25, 27, 29, this game may not be satisfying. Uh, you need a very accurate wheel. And, you know, this is a medium wheel, but compared to a G wheel, it's dramatically better. I've had, had them all over the years. I hadn't had the super high dollar ones, but I'm very happy with this wheel. It's so much better than any of the the G wheels but that's my setup a little look at some AI you know all I can say is work on your cars and uh, you know I have not raced here yet but if you do a search game has been out for what four days definitely people playing it online now you know, it, I have not tried it personally. I can't say anything to it yet. Uh, it's definitely on my list. Uh, championship still grayed out. Time trial still grayed out. Test day works, but what's the point? Anyway, enjoy. Bosco out.